Good morning, everybody. This is Crystal with Crystal's Creations Wyckoff. How are you all doing? Good, I hope. So today we get to spin the wheel of names for the winner of these stamp sets. Yay! Oh. <laughs> That's what we're gonna do. So I need to go over to my YouTube, so bear with me, which I forgot to write down everybody's names. So we're going to hit this little doohickey, put the square on that side, and then we're going to go over to Google, double click that, and then we're going to hit we're gonna hit YouTube and then we're gonna hit this and we're gonna go to my channel so I can find my video and then we're gonna go to the Team Tiny June 2022 hop We're going to hit pause because we don't need to hear me playing. That's for sure. And then I'm going to click down to... Wait, no. I need to go into comments. Where's the comments at? Where's the comments? I don't see my comments. Where's all the comments? Where did all the comments go, guys? 38 views. 13 likes. I don't see any of the comments. Where did it all go? <sighs> okay, we got some issues. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. All right, guys, we're back. I found the comments. Yay! <laughs> I literally, I think when I when I divided the, um, you know, when your, some of your laptops come with, um, oh, don't lean forward too far or your laptop will fall over the desk and it will be no more. Or we're going to have some serious issues. So, you know, when a lot of laptops, you can divide your screen in half. Well, um, I did that. A lot of times I do that. And this time I thought, well, I can just go to my YouTube channel on this side. Well, I couldn't find the comments. The comments somehow disappeared. And I should have I should have just went to my YouTube channel on my phone and did it that way. But it, it just doesn't work that way. It doesn't work. So I... I had to, you know, just do what I had to do. So, you know, it, it's, it is what it is. So, you know, it's all good. But we got it. I was able to find it. So I was like, yay. So I just had to put you guys on pause for a minute. I had to put my video on pause for a minute and I found them. So are you guys ready to spin the wheel? So we have, let me tell you who's all on the wheel. We have Don Wilcox, the Crafty Visage. And this time I will put, I will not forget. I tend to forget and I'm so sorry. This time I will put my Facebook group, um, I will put my Facebook group down in the description box. Okay, it will be at the top. So you guys can click on that link and that is how you can get a hold of me. Okay. And yeah, that is how you can get a hold of me. So if you win, please get a hold of me that way. And I will also post this in the Team Tiny Hop 2. So those of you that are part of the Team Tiny can also, yeah, you know how to get a hold of me and stuff. So anyways, also from there. Trying to make sure. I keep checking my phone because 
you know, I, my grandma is getting so close to, you know, she's so close. And I'm like, every time that phone makes a noise, I'm like, is it? I'm just so, just so, like, no, don't, don't, just hang on, hang on, Grandma. One more day, one more day for me, okay? So, you all know. So, okay. All right, let's, let's spin the wheel, shall we? All right, here it goes. Oh, I didn't finish reading the names, did I? I'm sorry. See, I'm spacey today. Okay, I don't know what it is. So, Don Wilcox, The Crafty Visage, Teresa Brown, Pod Popper's Place, and then I have a new subscriber, Platinum Diva 75 Arva. I watched a couple of her videos, so she's a really good. So, if you guys haven't subscribed to her, you might want to head on over to her channel. Um, she is really good, so I highly recommend her. Um, I believe she um, did her, I think she pronounced her name Arva. I think is how she pronounced it was Arva. Is how she says her name is Arva. So I think that's her name is Arva. So Arva, thank you for subscribing to my channel. So in, I subscribe to her channel now and she's really good. I like her cards. I love her stuff. She's really good. And then Wing It With Ross is another good one. Um, so if you're not subscribed to her, please go subscribe to her. And also to Therese Brown and Pod Popper's Place. And also Don Wilcox, The Crafty Visage, also has two new videos on her channel. She has a new, one new video and a short video. Um, she just started doing videos. So guys, please subscribe to her channel too. Um, Marcy M is a new subscriber to my channel. So thank you, Marcy M. Um, I don't know if you do YouTube channels. I'll look you up and see. If you don't, please let me know. Um, Mrs. H's Crafting Corner. Um, I still need to find a way to get a hold of you. But I will put my uh, thing in my description box. Ramona Mendez and Melissa Klepser. From good old Aski. Anyways, here we go. You guys ready? Three... Two, one, let's hit that wheel. All right, who's it gonna be? It's oh, Pod Popper's Place. Yay! And you are the winner of the love stamps. So this is yours. So we're gonna write. Odd poppers, please. So you get a new set of stamps. Yay! And these work. I've tried them. I love them. So these are for you. Okay. So now we're gonna remove pod poppers from the wheel because we don't want to spin her twice. She can't win twice in a row. Nope. No can do. Okay, so we just removed her from the wheel. So now, are we ready to see who gets the bird stamps? Let's see. I really like these birds. They're so pretty, you guys. And if you haven't seen them yet, let me take it. I taped a piece of paper on here. But look at these birds. There's a hummingbird in here. I may have to go back and get me a set though. But look at that. Isn't that pretty? Look, I see those. Look at that beautiful hummingbird in there. It's so pretty. I mean, you could even play with these if you have a gel press. You can use these on your gel press and everything. They're so pretty. And that really beautiful um, hibiscus flower. There's a hibiscus flower right there. It's a hibiscus because we grow them. We have a hibiscus flower plant right outside my craft room window. Yep. That's so pretty. I love it. Okay, let's see who gets the birds. All right, we ready? Three, two, where'd my mouse go? I can't find my mouse, guys. Uh-oh, we got a problem. <laughs> Technical issues. 
it's white and it's white over here and I can't find it. Now I found it. Okay, three, two, one, spin. All right, who's it gonna be? Wing it, wing it with Ross. Two of my Team Tiny Hoppers. You are the winner, wing it with Ross. You are the winner of the bird stamps. So I will put my and I know I'm pretty sure we can work Ross. You're down there. I don't know. And then while we're here, so I will remove her now. We will exit this. And I'm going to make my camera full. And then I wanted to show you guys something. My daughter is vacuuming. So hold on real quick. I'll close the door a second. Friday already. I can't believe it. Friday and it's cleaning day. So my daughter is cleaning for me, cleaning for us today, kind of giving us a break today. So um, yesterday um, I got a whole bunch of happy mail and finally my tiny diamond stencil came. Yay. Finally, because it was supposed to be in there with all the lunar paste and my tiny heart stencil. And this was not in there. My tiny diamond stencil was not in there. It was the only thing that was missing from the order. It took a while to finally get it, but I finally got it. And then I got this rack, rack, racket, racket package in the mail from a gal that lives in Lafayette, Colorado. And I totally wasn't expecting anything in the mail at all from anybody and I've been mailing out journals to some friends in my racket group and I completely forgot about this other racket group that I'm a part of on Facebook and I was like who is this and this is from so I'm not so sure if she watches my YouTube channel or not but Orvella Isle, if you watch this, thank you from the bottom of my heart. So if you're watching, thank you. I totally was not expecting this and I completely forgot I was part of this Facebook group. I tend to forget. I'm so, I'm a part of so many Facebook groups that I forget I'm a part of so many Facebook groups and it's like, and then Facebook notifications doesn't always work all the time and I don't get notified sometimes and it's like yeah I I don't know I I just yeah and I have my notifications on and I don't get half my notifications and I'm also an admin of one of the buy uh, the buy nothing sell nothing group in our area where I live and I don't even get I don't even get the notifications for that sometimes and it's like good grief it's like yeah it, it just it's it's frustrating sometimes when you don't get notifications like you're supposed to and it's like but yeah enough said about that but it's, I don't know if it's a technical thing on my phone or if it's just Facebook but yeah so anyways I got some happy mail yesterday from this girl named Orvella. Mind the vacuum cleaner. It's Friday. It's cleaning day. So she sent me a whole bundle of goodies. I mean a whole pile of goodies. So she sent me this baggie of hearts and circly stuff I can put on envelopes and stuff. So I will probably do the same thing because she sent me a little pink envelope with an idea. And she sent me a card that says hello and she said 
um, it says uh, happy crafting and it looks like she made this card out of an envelope and I don't know how she did that but it was clearly made out of an envelope so I don't know if you guys could see that very well but let me see I don't know if you guys could see that. That is like made out of an envelope. I mean, she really used her scraps well. I don't know how, but it's all smoothed out and everything. I, I mean, she, she did it well. I mean, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. <laughs> um, this was in it. So something I guess I can color that. Uh, some shiny shimmering paper. Another card I think she must have started making and I guess I can put the finishing touches and it said handmade with love on the back. <laughs> and then another piece of cardstock that was just folded in half, double sided. <laughs> like I and then some more pretty paper and then some of this really pretty peachy color with gold on it and then this white with gold flowers i can probably die cut some of that stuff and then a sheet of that and then this olive green with gold polka dots and then we have a pile of wood grain wrapping paper, which I know I can put to good use. And then a pile of um, this is by Brother something Brother and Sister something but this is more wrapping paper and it's white like a creamy white with gold goldish silver polka dots or maybe like a cheetah maybe it looks like animal print i don't know and then three of these envelopes obviously i think she made these because i have the same envelope maker that can make envelopes like this so she sent me four envelopes and then she sent me two dresses, so I think she stamped these, or die cutted them, stamped them and stuff like that. And then she sent me an origami dress, so I was trying to take apart this dress yesterday, but I didn't want to take it all the way apart. I'm like, okay, how do you, how do you make this? I was like trying really hard to take it apart, but I didn't want to take it apart all the way because I'm like, I don't know if I can get it back together. Because so I'm like, okay, I want to make this dress. Because that looks really cute. Because that could go on a girl's card. That can go on a ballerina or something. You can put it on a ballerina doll or, or something. Because it looks so cute. And then she sent me some flowers. And I have right back there, across from there, a whole spinny of flowers. And then got this to go on a card and then she sent me this thing it doesn't do anything at first I thought it was one of those card things you know that <laughs> one card thing that's not I think it's a I don't know I don't know if it's a something you put on a card or it's a card holder I don't remember but maybe it go, just goes on a card and then another one of these things but I don't know just something and then she sent me a bookmark with cats I guess I could make this another card for my neighbor down the street because she has cats I don't so she would love that and then she sent me three little butterflies and this is kind of like really cool paper it says midnight masquerade so three little butterflies Oh, let's see. I'm going to lower my camera so you guys can see that. So, you see those butterflies? So, there's the butterflies. 
And then she sent me, let's see, Midnight Masquerade. And then this one is, this is pretty wild cardstock. I've never seen cardstock like this before. Savor life and all its magic. So that is one side. And that is that set. And then this one is, oops, upside down. And then this is that side. And that is that side. So these could make some really cool cards. I mean, you could really do some mixed media, I think, on these. I mean, and my head is like spinning right now with those. And then yesterday I was having fun with my tiny diamonds. Okay. I was. And the first one I played with was my... Um, what was I doing? I was using Shooting Star, the yellow one, okay? And I turned it into a birthday card. Then I used some scraps. And I used my artist impressions. So I had gotten a bunch of free stuff from a gal who lives in Arvada. A lot of you know that by now. I was blessed with a ton of stuff. And that is one of the ones I did with that. So it's a birthday card for a family member of ours. And her birthday's today. And it's a little late. So, so sorry, Miss Sharon. <laughs> Auntie Sharon. Cousin Sharon. Whoever you are. I'm sorry. Just grin and bear it, okay? Your birthday card's a little late. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Your birthday card's a little late. Okay? Yeah. So. But. I used some of the stuff that I had gotten from that gal. Plus the tiny diamond stencil. I had fun with it. I was just going to town yesterday. Playing with it. And I like that tiny diamonds. And then I'll show you what I did. So where's all my solids first? So then I did triple berry. And then I did, so this is in lieu of not doing a live tomorrow. I am not gonna be here for a live tomorrow, guys. Okay, no live tomorrow. I'm gonna be crafting with a friend of mine tomorrow instead. Um, I will not be here for a live tomorrow. So this is why I'm doing this instead. And then I did this. This is uh, Prom Queen, Clear Skies, this is all Lunar Paste, okay, and then a couple of these I turned into a Flip It card, so this one is Later Gator, I think, or Minty Fresh, I'm not sure, I think this one's Minty Fresh. Minty Fresh, I think. And then this one is, I believe, Roar. I think Roar got turned into a card. And then I used, which one is this one? Psych. Also got turned into a card. And then I used Tropical Tango, Later Gator, and oh, that other orange. I always forget what its name is. Traffic Comb. So, Later Gator, Tropical Tango, and Traffic Cone is these two. So I put these two next to each other on my sticky mat and did opposite corners. That is what I did. So I was using up some of my scrap white papers to do all these uh, tiny diamonds. And I didn't do the flippy flip flop either. I just, just did it. And then I took two eight and a half by 11 white cardstock white papers that I had. 
and I just um, did a bunch of cleanup. And then I cut them down into a two size, eight and a half, or five and a half by four and a quarter sheets. That's how I did my cleanup. So I sprayed my, uh, I used my Tim Holtz sprayer with my Perfect Pearls in the bottom. So I just shook it until it got all that good glittery Perfect Pearl stuff, white stuff in there. And it leaves like glitter stuff on there. And so I use that with a card. So like I show you in here is what I did. I used some of that for a background for that card. There's the back side. Yeah, funny. Ah. Sharon's gonna get a hoot out of that card. I used my Tombow markers to color that card or to color the lady. And then there's another one of those for the cleanup. And then that one. And then here's another one I did. This is what I did. I kind of took um, Bethany um, BB Production, who also does YouTube videos. Um, I took her idea. Um, they take in your scallop knife and just doing different swatches. So this is every color that I have. And so this will be used. I think I will use this with some of my fish. With some of my fish from Memory Box. So this will get turned into fish. Or I might use it for my... I don't know. Maybe I'll do it. Fish. I think my fish. I don't know. Either fish or the... The... Um, the weed. Not the weed, but the... You know. Whatever it's called. Um, oh, um, coral. So I could do a couple fish and then some coral. That would look really pretty on the coral. It goes underwater. Oh, that would be so luscious. I mean, or I could just be a whole card scene, but... I think my fish, my memory box fish would look pretty on that, you guys. But I've been doing a lot of um, lunar paste, different designs and stamping and stuff and just doing all kinds of cleanup and doing fish, doing cutouts of fish that way too. So that is my video guys for today. So we are making up for what could have been tomorrow, but actually not really, because I'm not doing an hour long video, so that's it. So that was my video draw for the winner. I will post my Facebook group down below so you guys can get a hold of me, and I will also post this in Team Tiny, so that way you guys know who the winners are. So congratulations to Pod Popper's Place and to Wing It With Ross. So. And if they decide they don't want to win, I will do another video and pick two new winners. So, but I can't always remember if, but anyways, I will talk to you guys later. Um, always remember to do something fun. <laughs> um, uh, uh. Just be creative. Just, yeah, be creative. So anyways, talk to you later. Bye. Love you.